for YouTube. Not so fifteen for it's back today. Uh, it's been a bit, huh? So, my, sad news. My my mic kind of, not my mic, my aux cord for my headset kind of fizzled. So, I have a new aux cord, but it doesn't capture my mic, which sucks. So we're back to my computer's mic. But anyway, I thought I'd figure I'd chop my new blaster blade deck or my new build because this deck has changed when I built it for the first time and I shut it off. And gosh, the extra support's really, really helpful. But anyway, let's get into it. Um, so I played 12 crit, but I mean, and 4 heal. Pretty basic. Most of my decks are 12 crit for heal. Um, the only crits of note are basically Flogo, which I'm not going to go over what Flogo does. I've built how many with this card now? Um, and a long goal, who is put in soul plus 3k. Soul is a precious resource in the deck, so just the ability to have that if you, for whatever means need it, it's nice. You can also pump up your blaster blades. And then we'll go brace the starter. I'm not gonna go what it does. Um, next we're playing new card, a new card, so for something Leon. Um, her skill is, when she's a PG, except her condition's kind of cool. When she's placed on Garden Circle from hand, if you have an Alfred or Blaster Vanguard, you still boss one, and you PG. Yeah. It's pretty freaking stupid. That's why I have a long goal, in case for whatever reason we have enough soul, a long goal can get us more soul. Because the soul is our PG. <laughs> it's only super stupid. Um, they're on four Sisilis. If you can't, don't stride, your turn is basically dead. Granted, you do have ways to search out stride fodder, but it's still nice to be able to get that first stride pretty quickly. In case you need Wingle Brave, search out something. Then you need three Barkle, Barkle is counter charge, and three Wingle Youth. He lets you search out whatever you need, really. Um, he's really handy. They're running one Blaster Blade Spirit. Um, he's a 10k base that you can ride, and calling you out from the deck isn't that hard, to be honest. So it's it, it's a nice one of tech to have. Running three Star Hope Trumpeter, um, Star Hope Skill on place. She can basically get anything. I'm not going to go over most of her skills because you can read it on screen. And I've already built up for these cards. But yeah, she pretty much fetches whatever you need. She can fetch you Blaster Blade Spirit. She uses Blaster Blade her skill. If you get Blaster Blade with a float with a Barkle combo, she's essentially free on the Blaster Blade's 12k base. Yeah, then we have Lou. Lou does Lou things. We also have Blaster Blade, um, 3 Lou, and then 4 Blaster Blade. Blaster Blade's kind of the key of the deck. For a grade 3, is running 4 Blaster Blade Exceed. It's the Blaster Blade deck, I mean, come on. They're running four, um, something, bla new style Blaster Lou. So, Lou's skill is when it's placed on Vanguard or Radar Circle, take a Blaster away from your drop zone, put it on your deck, it gets 5k power. Which is really nice. So, you can recycle your Blaster Blade Exceeds to have infinite stride fodder. It's really, really useful. Then, uh, his secondary skills on Radar Circle and Guardian Circle, he gets Intercept, and he gets 5k shield, so, he's extra shield. It, Definitely matters. They're running one under Gis. Um, if you have two grade two uh, units, she's a 25k G guard, pretty nice. Two assaults. She's self-explanatory. She's insane. Four Alfreds. Alfreds kind of self-explanatory. One laser guard. Um, he's pretty good. Uh, four Altma. Altma fetches you out whatever you need. And then four Holy Peace Saver Gancelot. The most. Oh my gosh, this card is stupid. So he has two skills. His first skill is in the G zone. All, during your turn, all of your blaster blades get resist. So you can't be um, hetero hounded and you can't be denial griffin. Cause oh gosh, uh, playing this like I don't know, sucks. Cause Gansfall isn't out yet, so you can and it just sucks. But his main skill is when he attacks, if you have a blaster uh, or Alfred Heart, counter charge one. It gets plus one drive. So it's quad drive and if you have another face up card in your G zone it gets one crit literally you just this deck is literally Gancelot dot deck you just Gancelot people to death because you have four drive checks and then your blaster blades can restand with Fogles which is searchable through Star Hope it is the most dumb thing ever but I love it anyway uh, it's blaster blade it's IG I love it anyway but it's pretty stupid <laughs> um uh, in terms of like weaknesses for this deck, if you just like want to figure out ways to beat the deck, I mean, I will say Kagro gives this deck 
a harder time than other decks. Anything like, um, things this deck's good against. Anything like Great Nature, or like, something that like needs time to build a presence, this, this deck wrecks. Um, going for, being able to like just G guard, like have the G guard out and then just bam, start attacking with crit. Basically anything that needs time to set up this deck will wreck. You, you need to kill this deck. It's kind of like Lard in the sense where you need to kill it quickly because you have, you're never gonna go through all four gant slots. If you manage to survive four gant slots, you're a freaking legend. Like, real talk, you're, you're some kind of legend. <laughs> but yeah, um, that's gonna do it for this deck profile. This has been, uh, Natsu Sasuke, Fairy Tale, signing out.